just got scanned for 2K. Welcome everyone to the NBA on 2K Sports. I'm Kevin Harlan. We've got Steve Smith and Greg Anthony alongside and our sideline reporter tonight, David Aldridge. So the opening lineup for the Suns. They've got Dimes, Tiny out there with T. Then it's Mr. Clutch, and it's AI in at the five. And for the Heat, Johnson is out there with Miller. And it's Cool Hands. Then there's the great one, and it's Wilson in at the two. And looking at the explosiveness on the four tonight, Steve, this game should be filled with highlight real plays. I love it, Kevin. Fans love watching these matchups, and we do too. And so the tip-off, it's Miami. Passes it to Johnson. Knocked away. And Phoenix pushing it up now. Here's Mr. Clutch. That shot, no good. And Miami the other way now. The 11-footer. Another shot. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. Yeah, good job to take it right at the deep. The Suns shooting their first free throws of the game. Number two, two. Take a break, take a break. Two shots. No good on the free throw. You know, Smitty, what's incredible about Miami's D, they don't need to block a ton of shots to protect the rim. Kevin, it's all about awareness, communication, and positioning. Whether they're in zone or man, they stay completely connected almost every possession. Good on the second free throw. Now, Greg, a disappointing ending to the playoffs last season, certainly for the Phoenix Suns. Well, came in the top seed in their conference only to make a second round exit after a grueling game seven. So this season might be revenge time for this group. Now, here is Miller. Six on the shot clock. Pass to T. Beyond the arc. Kept alive. And it's Miami's ball. Stolen away. We play just over a minute here in the first. Wilson grabs the board. Oh, you, you've got to be able to deliver when you get a bunny like that. That's just too easy of a shot to miss. Outside, Taylor. Pass to Martinez. To the left side wing. Lock at six. Wilson kicks to Taylor. And he misses his first shot. And he's a good shooter from outside, but not sure from that deep. You know, we're seeing players move further and further back to create space. But that does make it a tougher shot. Now, here's Taylor. There's the pass to Miller. Fader on the way. Yep, that one goes. Great job executing the offense. That pass on time and on point. Here's Mr. Clutch. Pass to Dimes. Here's Mr. Clutch. Pass to T. The three. Here's Tiny. Fouled on the shot and picks up two points. So one free throw coming up. Effort play pursuing the basketball. Love how he puts in the work. The Suns shooting their third free throw attempt of the game. Number 49. One. One shot. And that one misses. And of course, one of the league's longest tenured coaches, GA, is Eric Spolster. And he's having a Hall of Fame level career. And you look at the ground he broke when he was first hired. Not only young, Spo was the first Asian American head coach in any of the four major North American sports league and worked his way up from video coordinator. 
The Suns trailing. Dimes the pass to T. About three minutes gone here in the first quarter. Here's Dimes. Shot clock at six. It's going to be out of bounds. The Suns will retain possession. And now let's take a look again at that incredible rejection. And making a statement right away, letting them know they won't get any easy ones when he's around. We've got 155 left in the first quarter. For Miami, they've gone two of five here, making 40% so far to start out the game. Wilson the pass to Martinez. Now here is Miller. Wilson with it. Down to five on the shot clock. Baseline J on the way. It's hauled in by the Suns. He looked just a little out of rhythm. He's still trying to establish consistency from there. T the pass to Ayan. Knocked loose. Johnson with the block. And the ball goes out of bounds. Last touch by Johnson. And first time out of the game called for Phoenix. Trying to find some answers offensively. Yeah, these guys need to work together as a team, as a unit. Try and carve out some easy buckets. One twelve left here in the opening quarter. Six to shoot. Mr. Clutch, and he converts the layup. And once he got to the 10, I think he was surprised to find himself that wide open. Wow, that's a defensive breakdown. Can't do that against good scores. Now, here's Wilson. He's still scoreless so far in this one. Let's it go from deep. Good on the three-point shot. We've seen the lead change hands quite a bit in this one. And guys, I think each team knows they can win this game. Just a matter who can catch that momentum. Here's Mr. Clutch. And AI throws it down. And for a power forward, he can sure get up. I mean, because of that leaping ability, it kind of offsets his height disadvantage. Now here's Wilson. Johnson surveying the floor. Pass to Martinez. And too much time in the lane. They get called for the three-second violation. Here's Dimes. The pass to Mr. Clutch. One second left. And the last shot before the buzzer is off. It's all tied in Miami. And back in a moment as we'll get underway with quarter number two. Fans, please give a big round of applause. And if you're just tuning in, it's been a pretty even game through the first quarter. And let's quickly break down the game we've seen from Miami, guys. You could see they were well prepared defensively coming into this one. Yes, what they do, they take away the things that teams like to do offensively. Also, keeping them out of sync. Well, Phoenix shooting 23% from the field. That's not going to get it done. And talking about a franchise that has done a complete 180, look no further than the Phoenix Suns. Before 2021, they hadn't even been to the playoffs in 10 years. Setting the floor for the Suns. They've got AI. Mr. Clutch out there with Dines. Then it's Tiny, and it's T in at the three spot. And it's the Heat with the ball after the Suns pick up two. Back to Taylor. 
and the call on the shot that sends him to the line. In just four seasons, Phoenix Gregg went from last in the conference to the best record in the entire NBA. It's been an unbelievable story. And there's a lot of talent on this team, not to mention a great coach in Monty Williams. The future is bright for this franchise. Free throw good, Taylor. Taylor drops them both. Greg, we know from time to time things get pretty chippy out there. What kind of things would get under your skin when you played in the NBA? Oh, you know, guys tended to talk a little trash, and that could rattle you. That, that could bother you at times, but you really just try to maintain your focus and keeping your eye on the prize. Good job of stepping up to the plate there, seizing back the momentum for his team. That's the competitor in him. Close game. Let me have this one. Now, here's Wilson. Outside, Taylor. Five on the clock. Misses the wing J. Miss opportunity. It's a makeable shot for him. He just can't get it to go. Here's T. Miller grabs the miss. Miller's got his fifth rebound right now in the game. Now, here's Taylor. He's started closer. And he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. And this is his second trip to the line tonight. Now at the line, Taylor! Two shots. And he makes the first. And Taylor drops them both. The Suns have gone two or three from the field here to open the second quarter. Dimes the pass to T. Here's Dimes. A fadeaway. And Miller with the block. Outside Wilson. And we're about two minutes into the second quarter here. Johnson in the corner to the paint. Here's Martinez. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. The Heat shooting their fifth and six free throws of the game. And last season, when they got themselves to the line, they usually came through as a team up around 81%. Ties it up, and this next one could give them the lead. No good on the second free throw. He wanted to get his team the lead, and even though he didn't, he should feel good. At least he tied it up. Here's T. He's guarded by Johnson. Passes it to Tiny. From downtown, and Martinez with the block. Taylor taking his time here to the middle. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. You know, I love how he absorbs the foul and still had a chance to knock that one down. The Heat shooting their seventh and eighth attempts at the foul line tonight. Two 
and that one falls, and that puts him up by one point. The quickies check in for Tiny. So he gets them both. Here's Dimes. Five points in the game. We're just over two and a half minutes into the second quarter. The 10-footer. And Miller with the block. And he recovers it. Dimes the pass to the quick. Here's T. And foul on the shot. So he'll get a chance at the line. For Phoenix, they have shot one of three from the line tonight, missing two earlier on. And they had a lot of success a season ago as a team, hitting about 80% of their free throws. Shooting two. That free throw missing. The Heat making a switch here. Williams is checked in. The Beast, he's checked in for Phoenix. He hits the second from the line. The Heat with the lead. Outside Wilson. And for those of you just joining us in the second quarter with about three minutes gone by, trying to get open is Miller. Shots good by Williams. Williams has got the lead up to three now for the Heat. Not just selling for something along the perimeter. Excellent job. Here's Dimes. He has five. That's tipped. Williams with the steal. Right side, Taylor. Outside, Wilson. Back to Taylor. Shot clock at six. Kicks it out to Johnson. They get a hand on it. And the great shooters know when they've got enough opening to go for the three. I didn't think it was a bad choice on that possession. And with that, the Heat lead is cut down to just one on the basket for Mr. Clutch. And really, it's been a major aspect of their offense in the early stages here. Their success working the ball inside and getting points from close range. Now, here's Taylor. Puts it up from 15. Second chance effort, and Williams with the nice bucket inside. Williams has got four points in the quarter. The tenacity on the interior, just battling, bringing that effort and will for second chance points. Here's Mr. Clutch. It's hauled in by the Heat. Three second difference between shot clock and game clock. Right side, Wilson. It's tipped. Here's Mr. Clutch. Over to the left wing. Here's T. And some good action through the first two quarters as we reach halftime. Miami ahead, leading by three. And now we'll send it over to David Aldridge, who is standing by courtside. David. Thanks, Kevin. Coach, you... All right, thank you, David. And folks, don't go away. After the break, we'll see you right back here for the start of quarter number three. And now, the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hey, everybody. Good to see you back here on our halftime show. Well, actually, we can't see you, but you can see us, but you get it. Ernie Johnson, Kenny the Jet Smith, Shaquille O'Neal. You're watching the NBA on 2K Sports. It was a closely contested first quarter for Miami. 
the period wrapped up with the teams on level ground and the score tied. And so far, they're out in front, but not by much as we head into the half. Kenny, let's start with you. What do you think about the Heat? Well, as well as they perform offensively, I'm surprised that they haven't opened up a significant lead. I mean, the passing shops are shooting well, they're making good decisions, but they haven't opened up the game yet. That could be difficult. And over to Shaq, what did you think about Phoenix? I like to see them get to the line more. But to do that, you got to be aggressive. Force the action, drive the lane, make the defense react to what you're doing. If they can do that, I think they have a good chance of pulling out a win. And that'll do it for us. The third quarter about to begin with Kevin Harlan standing by. We'll catch you on the flip side, my brother. And as we get into this third quarter, as we've seen so far, neither team able to create much separation on the scoreboard yet. Here's Dimes. We've got Johnson. Taylor is out there with Wilson. And it's Cool Hands, and it's Miller in at the four spot. So that's who Eric Spolstra starts the second half with. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. Phoenix shooting their sixth and seventh free throws in the game. For Phoenix, number two, two. First one falls for him. And so he's able to get one of two. And for the Heat, they're shooting a lackluster 38% for the game, struggling so far. Now, here's Taylor. D right on him. Martinez. With the fadeaway. Tiny grabs the board. The Suns trailing. Here's Mr. Clutch. To the wing on the left. Here's A.I. and Martinez with the block. A.I.'s gone one of three from the field here. Johnson outside. Pass to Miller. And here's Wilson. Out left of the wing. Just five on the clock. Here's Martinez. And he gets the basket. Officials blowing the whistle. So a chance at the line for one more. And you got to love the big bucket in the paint in this sort of a grind it out game. The Heat have been good at the free throw line in this one, seven of eight. Find the length. Find the length. One. One shot. And the Suns call time here. I'm trying to find some answers offensively yeah these guys need to work together as a team as a unit try and carve out some easy buckets
Suns trail by five. Some tough offensive sets. They want to turn it around. Yeah, right now you just need a bucket to get some momentum. Here's Dimes. Miami grabs the miss. Johnson outside. A shot missing. The Suns have gone 0-3 and are still looking for that first bucket here in the second half. Pass to Dimes. There's Mr. Clutch. Here's T. Let's go. And a little luck that time, but it drops. And that pick takes the D totally out of the equation. Hey, if you're not going to fight over, you're essentially giving the shooter the look he wants. Now here's Taylor. Snatched away. To the inside. Here's Mr. Clutch. And the layup is good after a nice lead pass. And it's now only a one-point heat lead. Not just swinging the ball around the perimeter. Aggressive move inside. And the foul called on Dimes. That'll be his second foul of the game. Davis has checked in for the Heat. Smith comes in for Johnson. And a change for the Suns. The greats checked in for AI. And we got to take a second look to admire that outstanding block. And this is why coaches stress the importance of defense. Big block there in this close game. Outside, Taylor. Well, we're into the third quarter, just over two and a half minutes play. Miami no good on that time either. Here's Mr. Clutch. The great cool hands grabs the rebound. Martinez has got five rebounds tonight. The pass to Taylor. On the wing, Davis. Passes to Smith. Outside, Taylor. Lock at six. Pulls up on the elbow. And it is flushed down with a nice jam. There's no bigger play in a close game than a putback slam. Oh, and that one's got them all hyped up. Wow. They're bringing the energy, the hustle, the fight, and they also didn't give up on that possession. That evens the score. That's now eight points for Dimes. This is the shot you want to get him. An open look from range. Time out, time and Miami out. calls their first time out of the game. And, and coaches looking to seize every advantage, maximize every possession. Critical part of the game. You have to be flexible. You have to be able to adjust what you're doing. And the Heat with some changes. Clark, he's checked in for Davis. And it's Garcia in for Smith. And then for Phoenix, Mr. Clutch comes in for the great. And it's Doc in for Mr. Clutch. Now here's Taylor. Pass to Cool Hands. Miami no good on that time either. Phoenix has gone one of two from beyond the arc since coming out of the break. Dimes the pass to Mr. Clutch. And down it goes. Dunk through off a wonderful assist. And he's an automatic finisher when he gets into that area. He is, and he picks the simple one-hand stuff to get the two points. Now, here's Wilson. Outside, Garcia. And again, it's the Heat missing. I tell you what, the defense should send Christmas cards for that miss. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. The Suns have shot three of seven at the foul line. Number 14, two. And the first one at the line is good. A different look for Miami. Brown comes in for Clark. 
And it's Johnson in for Garcia. AI is checked in for the Suns. The general comes in for Doc. And that's good as he hits both of his shots. 34 seconds left here in the third quarter. Guys are looking for a spark here. Yeah, a cold stretch offensively for sure. Here's Martinez, and he banks in the layup. Martinez has got 10 points in the game. Beautiful call that time up the floor. The hard screen frees him up for the bunny. Here's Dimes. He's got 10. Taylor with a rebound. Great defensive effort. Just saved a basket. You know what? This is why you never give up on a play. You don't know what's going to happen. It's still anybody's game as we've reached the end of three. Suns lead by two. And we'll have the start of the fourth quarter for you as soon as we get back from this short break. And let's go back to a terrific pass that we're calling tonight our State Farm assist of the game. Yeah, an easy choice tonight. Look at the precision on this pass. Put it on a platter form. This is why you preach teamwork. Some of the most spectacular plays are the ones where guys are feeding off one another. Here we go. And it's been a very competitive game so far as we get rolling here in quarter number four. Setting the floor for the Suns. Mr. Clutch out there with Dimes. Then it's Tiny. Then it's T. And it's AI in at the five down low. Now here's Martinez. And stolen by AI. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. And some stats here, guys. The scoring breakdown for the Suns. Smart ball handling from them in this one. Passing around to get ahead of the defense and putting it in the hands of ready shooters. And all game long, they, they worked the ball inside. It's really worked well for them offensively. He's off on the first. They aren't making anything at the line today. This is a team that struggles at the line. And he's good on the second. Now here's Taylor. Johnson outside. Heat moving the ball around. And looks like the illegal pick was set. Yep, that's right. That'll get their attention. And those are the kinds of mistakes that are magnified when we're talking about a game down the stretch. Williams, he's checked in for Martinez. Suns leading by three. Dimes, the pass to T. AI outside. Over to the wing. Here's Dimes. And that one hits back iron. And it's Miami's ball. Johnson outside. Pass to Miller. Up and in on the layup. And you don't want to allow too many of those short ones with the game right now in the bounce. Dimes the pass to T. A shot that time, not on target. And uh, Miami shooting at 36% of the night. They've got to step it up offensively. 
Taylor kicks to Wilson. The pass to Johnson. Offside Williams. Six on the shot clock. To take the lead. And they'll get another chance. And he battles for the ball and gets the second chance bucket. There's a certain resiliency to this team, and you're starting to see it. Well within striking range. Now is when you have to lock in at both ends. Here's Mr. Clutch. Passes it to T. Shot, high post. And it's Miami with the rebound. Wilson's got his fourth rebound in this one. Right side, Taylor. Wide open. Oh, they get it back. Williams. Up again. He hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. Miller's got four points this quarter. And that's a pure hustle play, getting to the offensive glass for the tip -in. And that's the kind of quality you see in any strong offensive rebounder, isn't it? Here's T. And the call is going to be... Green. Yes, yes green. it is, an illegal screen. Uh, beyond the leaning, you can see his feet more set on that screen. Easy call. So difficult to stay planted, especially with all the motion around you. Annoying turnover. Brown is checked in for Williams. Now here is Miller. Johnson kicks to Taylor. It's Brown on the wing. He's guarded by AI. Taylor up top. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. You know, we talk a lot about scoring efficiency. He's displaying the exact opposite. Here's Dines, rejected by Taylor. Johnson left side. Number 41. First person Two shots. First wow. team foul. Two. And an important part of every team's game, a look at the hustle stats for the Heat. What I love, and the coaching staff has to love, is the defense. They've really brought the energy with all these blocks we've seen in this one. And another thing they did well was just keep the effort up offensively. Lots of boards leading to extra opportunities, which they converted. And he cannot get the first one to drop. Tough one to miss. Williams, he's checked in for the Heat. And the second of two is good. That gives them a four-point cushion. And the Suns call time. They're trailing by four. 121 left in the fourth quarter. I want to see you get loud. Here comes the teacher. Now a moment to present the New Balance Player of the Game, Houdini. 
And in terms of his shooting, this has been one of the more accurate performances you'll ever see. I mean, he's been in constant motion, creating a lot of good looks for himself. But, but still, even when you're wide open, you expect to miss some of the time. That has not been the case here tonight. This guy has made everything. A moment now to hear from our sideline reporter, Hall of Famer, David Aldridge. David. Hey, Kevin, here's what Monty Williams went over with his team during the timeout. He told them, don't look at the scoreboard. It's 0-0. Zero, zero. One play at a time. Execute the game plan. That's how we're going to win this game. Kevin, he's trying to keep him focused. Thank you, David. And the free throw, no good. And here's Miller. He'll bring it up for Miami. They've played a great fourth quarter defensive, allowing only three points. Here's Dimes. Pass to Tiny. Here's Dimes. Five to shoot from outside the arc. The shot by T, no good. And here's Miami. The lead is two. They'll be trying to take as much time off the clock as they can. Exactly. Expect to see longer possessions from this point on. Wilson kicks to Johnson. Now here's Taylor. Tight defense on him. You had a foul to give there, but you'd rather not have it cost you your team points. First personal foul, second team foul. Now at the line, Taylor! Shoot two. He doesn't hit the first, and that was the one they really wanted. He's got one more, though. So he comes up empty at the line. Yeah, just a golden opportunity that's lost right there now we still got a game mr clutch's shot is off well, they foul intentionally that's what they have to do at this point he had to foul and on that occasion to stop the clock that's the enemy in this situation now the line taylor two shoot two He hits the first one, and that makes it a three-point lead. And he hits both free throws here. So now it's a four-point ball game. Tremendous showing of confidence by getting those two to fall. And the Suns call time. They're trailing by four. 15 seconds left here in the fourth quarter. Guys, your thoughts? An uphill climb. They need everything to break their way. They also need to get the best shot you can as quickly as you can, and then immediately foul. Or 
Puts it up. Off the inbound. Dimes no good. And an intentional foul there stops the clock. Number 14. Third personal foul. Team foul number four. Now at the line, Taylor! Two. Shooting two. And he misses the first one. Boy, he wanted that one to fall. And he ends up making the second, and that puts them up by five. Pass to T. Fires from deep. Doesn't go for him. And so it's the Heat winning this one. They didn't make it easy on themselves or their fans, but in the end, everyone's satisfied. I mean, there were some times that that momentum shifted, and, and, and especially early on, but let's give this group a lot of credit for that stick to it to miss in terms of finishing out and executing that game plan. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. Now for Greg Anthony, Steve Smith, and David Aldridge. This is Kevin Harlan. Thanks for watching the NBA here on 2K Sports. So long and good night, everyone.